guys, it's Hannah and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to put um, a picture within your thumbnail um, as an overlay. I get a lot of questions about it and it's been requested a lot for me to do a video like this so that's what I'm going to be doing today. And keep in mind that this is a tutorial on how to do the overlay for the thumbnail. So if you want to know how to make a thumbnail, like the basics of making a thumbnail, then you can go and head over to my other video where I show you the basics and like adding text and the dimensions of a thumbnail and everything like that. Um, I'll have it at the top right of the screen and I'll also have it um, linked down below. So yeah, so I'm just starting out with a blank white canvas just to show you guys so I'm going to head over to the overlays um, little section which is the butterfly and I'm going to put add your own and I'm just going to grab a picture um, really quick to demonstrate okay so I'm just going to use this picture I took of a bluebird a few months ago so yeah I've now selected the picture and what you're going to do right when you add in the overlay is you're going to go to this little button which is the eraser tool so what I have done is I have just turned the eraser size up to 74 so you can see that the eraser is much larger now and the eraser hardness is at 82 percent which is okay for me to erase these the um, background but when I do um, up close to the bird I am going to lower the hardness down to about 20 percent so but right now I'm going to keep it up high so yeah, I'm just going to begin by erasing the background. Okay, so now I'm going to lower the hardness to about 20% and I'm also going to lower the eraser dive a little bit so I can really get in detail with this and you definitely want to take your time you don't want to rush it thumbnails are definitely one of the most important things and you can also zoom in by using this over here zooming in definitely helps you a lot as well And if you were to mess up, you can go to this paintbrush um, button right here and it will paint back on the original photo. And I definitely would do a better job than this if I was actually doing this like for real. But I am just doing this to show you guys how. So yeah, definitely take your time.
Okay, and then you can switch back over to basic when you are done, and then you can adjust the size of it and put it however you would like. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope it was helpful. Um, give it a thumbs up if it was, and don't forget to subscribe for future videos. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!